It's a piggy bank. He's super easy to make. I've got free plans, and I want to thank Janae Myers for the inspiration to build this project. First, I'm going to glue up these two boards for the cutout on the inside of the bank. Since most of this gets cut away, I can just clamp this together by screwing it together. Now over at my bandsaw, I can cut out the center of the bank. The entry point of my bandsaw is going to become the coin slot. And that slot is just wide enough for a quarter to fit into. I'm gonna sandwich that piece between two larger boards. I'll glue each half of this up separately. While that's drying, I'm gonna get started on the pig's face. Here I'm shaping his ears and giving him some nostrils. I'm rounding over the edges of his face and snout. I'm going to epoxy his ears onto his head. And get his nose too. I got a little bit of a tricky problem here to figure out once I put this other piece on where to position the cutout. What I'm going to do is just kind of make a mark. So my thought is now I can glue this on and even it up with the sides. Well, with that, you can tell it's, it's really starting to look like a pig. <laughs> now I can line this template up to the edges. I can drill a hole in the underside of the pig. I picked up this little plastic grommet at the hardware store. Now I can glue his head on. I had a couple of ideas for making his tail. I tried curling a couple of different types of wire and while it looks okay that way, it seems rather flimsy and actually this might poke a child's hand. And I thought about cutting some sort of a spiral out of wood, but I think it would break off real easily. So in the end, I think I'll end up just painting a curly tail on him. <laughs> in the end. <laughs> I'm gonna give him a base coat of pink paint. I've included this drawing in the plans in case you wanna to try to copy this face, or you can just come up with your own. I'll try to sketch this out first and then apply the paint. Give the bank some protection with a few coats of spray lacquer. And that's all there is to the piggy bank. Super easy and fun project. Again, check in the description. I've got free plans. <laughs> There's his tail. It'd make a great gift for a kid or an adult if you want to save up some money. I'm hoping I can fill this up and send my son to college. If this is your first time here, you should know that I make new woodworking videos every Friday. It would behoove you to subscribe. Behoove. Don't forget, you can like Woodworking for Mere Mortals over on Facebook. And you can follow me on Twitter. And I want to thank all of you who have been helping to support the show over on Subbable.com. If you'd like to get involved, visit Subbable.com slash woodworking. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next Friday.